today I am quite four-eyed today, but it's just that type of day. Let me fix myself. Hello, it's China Eastern. I don't know, today is a little bit different. Um, most people probably know watching my channel by now that this specific playlist is about my last year of college. And the reason why I started it is mainly because it's kind of like my last year of being in an institutional education system. And I kind of wanted to see, you know, what this would be like years from now or months from now. But it's also sort of like, like my video diary. And um, so today I'm kind of feeling like just, you know, in a talking mood. Talking about some of the changes that I've had so far. I know I haven't made a video in a while. And mostly because my schedule has been like not consistent the last like two weeks. Um, I'm definitely trying to figure out you know, when am I going to make a video and release it and what day will that be and so that I can be consistent. I'm working on that and I will definitely officially let you guys know when I'll be releasing these videos every week um, and hopefully they'll be a little bit more interesting. But some of them will be just me talking because, um, like I said, this is sort of like my last year of college video journal. But speaking of all the changes, these last two weeks have been crazy. But before I get into that, I need to adjust this camera because it's kind of tilted. So, uno, one second. All right. <laughs> I think that's a little bit better. Okay. Know, everything in my life, I sort of have to capture like I always have my camera or my camera phone you know Instagram or Snapchat available because I'm like this is a moment in my life that's worth capturing and I want to remember um and I want to share it with the world and so I was thinking about YouTube and I was thinking about me and like the psychology behind this desire to constantly want to record myself in my life and moments in my life and share it with the world. What does that do to my mind? How does that change me? Am I purposely doing things to display for YouTube? Honestly, I don't know like how I got to this idea, but I was thinking about, you know, man, I need to learn to I need to learn the difference between uh, freely living and living freely. Where I am right now in my life, I feel like I'm, I'm, I'm trying to explore me. I'm trying to be more authentic. Just, you know, in this life, I'm just going to do things more freely, like without any rules, any laws, or, you know, anything, you know, chaining me down or what, whatever it is. In that, I feel like there's so much I can get lost between just living. Trying to freely live rather than just live freely. I think there's a huge difference because... For me at least, the difference is like I'm trying, I'm thinking very much about like, okay, what's going to make me feel free rather than like living life. And it might be one and the same thing, you know, I might just be thinking too hard about it and that's the whole reason for the, the phrase. But, um, but yeah, I think I'm in this place where I'm trying to learn what that means. There's this urge in me to like not want to do my, to study for my homework at all, like do my homework at all. And this tension of really, really like, I'm just not going to do it. And I'm just going to expect that I'll pass. And it's like, I don't know if it's senioritis and maybe that's what I need to just call it. But uh, it just feels like a lot harder to do what I need to do. Anyway, so I sort of have a bae. Y'all, my hair is like... Y'all, my hair is on the struggle today. Just, just forget that it, it looks like this right now. I'm realizing that what I like and what I'm attracted to is changing. I would have never saw this coming. Like, <laughs> I would have never imagined this is where I would go and this is what bae would be like. Like, I just, I guess that's just part of life. You don't imagine stuff would happen the way that, that it is. And actually, I don't believe in types anymore. There is no such thing to me anymore. I like what I like, and I know when I like it. That's what I go with. I don't really stick with a, like, a physical type. As far as, like, 
personalities go maybe there's more of a type there because I've seen a pattern in the type of guys that I've been attracted to they're usually talented in some form of art so I've I definitely know that notice there's a string there and I'm really attracted to, to smart like philosophical people oh my gosh y'all So somebody just walked by my window and I'm just like, what the crap? But yeah, so that's that. I'm definitely a motivated person uh, when it comes to things that I want to do. And don't get me wrong, sometimes I lose momentum. Like right now, I definitely feel like I've been in the place where I've lost a little momentum because I've sort of lost vision a little bit. Like. I sort of lost the vision of what I want to do and how I want to create stuff. I'm sort of in this search for like new inspiration and new motivation to get me back to the reasons why I want to keep doing what I was planning on doing before. It's just like, it's just like figuring out the in-between. There's something that I'm missing to make it happen and so I need to do, I need to figure out what that is. I think that's what also has been changing uh, this, so far, this school year is my time management. I definitely don't have a lot of things taken on my schedule. I only have two classes. They are three credit courses. They don't require a lot of work. They just require reading. Like, I feel like I've really put the lax on my time management because I only have two classes. So I'm like, oh, well, I only have two classes, so yeah, we do. But I really do need to buckle down on my time management. That's my video journal for today. Thank you for watching. I will see you guys the next time I upload a video. <laughs> Again, you can follow me at Yep Eastern on Instagram. Alright, you guys, have a great day.